this happening on the weekend of uh, Crystal Knock. It's also known as the Night of Broken Glass. About 86 years ago, it had marked the beginning of the Holocaust in Nazi Germany as a program was brought against the Jewish people throughout Europe. To give tribute today, 250 high schoolers across Palm Beach County sat down to hear the stories of some 27 local Holocaust survivors. Those survivors say this day represents an extraordinary opportunity to learn and bear witness to the atrocities of the Holocaust. Our photojournalist David Cohen brings us this special inside look at the event. Hearing the stories of these survivors firsthand, they had the opportunity to hear from somebody who lived through the atrocities of Auschwitz. They saw the tattoo. Of course, everybody hears about the concentration camps, but it's different when you actually meet with a the survivor. They will remember this, and this is what we ask of them. Please, remember that you met a the survivor. There's more emotion between them. And instead of like learning through a video, I'm actually talking to them. I can ask questions, and it's more memorable. I almost teared up a couple times. The real life dark aspect and how people lived it and how they were able to shine through, it's just that you don't get that from a piece of paper. These students today are the last generation of students that will ever hear history from the lips of someone who is there. Easy to say like, oh, that was so long ago, but like meeting a person who actually had to go through this, it made me feel like really sad. Anti-Semitism didn't start with the Holocaust, and anti-Semitism didn't end with the Holocaust. Anti-Semitism occurs every day. When you see something bad happening, stop right there, say something, do something. If there is that such rise that it's bringing concern that way, then we really need to shut it down. Us Jews are exactly the same as everybody else. Uh, we are human beings just like everyone else. Nobody should have to go through that type of prejudice. Just because of your religion, you know, we all, we all bleed red blood, you know, we're all the same. Never again, and nowadays, it's never again, now.